It was a relief last week when Toronto School Board voted not to sell off uh, schoolyards and playgrounds to raise money for school repairs the way Dalton McGuinty wanted them to. A relief because uh, schools and their playgrounds are part of the same thing, a healthy public life. You shouldn't have to cut off your arm and sell it to fix your broken leg. We don't have enough spaces that work in a public way, no matter who owns them, including uh, local pubs and cafes. Schoolyards fill that role. Uh, parents take kids when they're little and meet other parents. Kids come after school and shoot hoops. Uh, people exchange neighborhood news, dropping their kids off or picking them up. Everybody gathers for fireworks. It helps create a shared reality where you live so you don't have to get up, go to work or school and go home again. But where will the money come from to fix the schools? Surely the only answer to that can't be sell off precious public spaces to build condos. You have to start by knowing what you value and why and proceed from there. Those places aren't just random assets or chips to cash in. They make and break communities. For the Star.com, I'm Rick Salutin. Mm -hmm.